So today I'm back out here with Face. Face, I picked you up. We're on our way to an appointment you have for uh, tattoo removal. Are you excited? Yes, I am. I'm very excited. Uh, what are you? What are you most excited about? Uh, I'm excited about getting the, the the tattoos removed. I've had them there for for a minute, but um, I'm I'm looking to change my life over, do something positive, positive for myself, uh, positive for the community, uh, set an example for others to follow. This is a, a step in that direction, huh? Definitely. Uh, laser removal is definitely if, if if you have face tattoos, laser removal is definitely a positive move in the right direction. And what do they say? Did they say this is a consultation, or it's you're actually gonna get it, gonna get them removed, or they're gonna start the removal process today? Uh, they said that we have just a little bit of paperwork to do, uh, a little consult uh, consultation, and then from there I'm gonna go under the under the laser gun. Are you uh, any anxiety? I got some anxiety because they said it's painful, but. Uh, I just have to wait and see how it feels. Was it painful when you got the, the, got the tattoo on your face? Definitely, it was very painful. The eye, the nose, the cheek, the lips, just about everything on my face was, was very, very painful. Uh, I did it, I, I wasn't high, I wasn't drunk. Of course I did it when I was doing time. I had access to all that stuff to know me, but I, I chose not to do it. I chose to do it uh, sober. And, uh... Did they say how many times you have to come out here to for this process? Because it's not going to be done in one sitting, right? No, they, they said it's, it's going to be a process. Uh, once a month, they're going to schedule me once a month to come in and, and have this procedure done until we're, com uh, until we're completely done with my face. And then we'll talk about the neck and the hands and possibly other other areas of my body. But definitely the face for, uh, first, huh? Yes, definitely the face first. Is this, uh, what type of program is this? For them? Is this just uh, they're trying to help the community, this organization, or what? Yes, um, uh, I, I'm not sure where they're funded or if they are funded, but I, I know that, that they're, they want to offer their services to, to help the public, to help others out who are in a similar situation as I am. That's really nice of them, right? So I'm glad that there's programs out here. Um, so to all the youngsters out there that are they're young and they think it's cool to have tattoos all up in the face, the neck, everywhere, what, uh, what advice do you have for them about that? Uh, definitely think about it real hard. Uh, weigh wait, wait the, the goods with the cons part of it and uh, make, make the best decision you can make because uh, look at, like right now here, I'm going to get mine removed. So uh, it's something to think about. Because tattoos don't go away. Permanent, huh? They're permanent. Unless, of course, you get laser, laser removal. Any regrets when you got them on? Like, should you have said no? Or just, you know what, I'm not, not right now? Or what do you think? Well, I kind of put myself out there. Uh, of course, when you're doing time, you're all about your word. And, and so uh, I said, yeah, I'll get tattoos only if they're for free. I don't want to pay no money, get nothing, get no ink put on my face. And they say, well, you hit the right spot. And sure enough, I did. And next thing I know, I'm going under the tattoo gun, getting tattoos on my face. Because I couldn't go back on my word. Because your word is everything. And uh, it's one thing to have them you know, in there, right, when you're in lockup, but when you get out here to the, this world, it's different, right? They're received differently, right? Yes, definitely. <clears throat> um, the reception that I received was, for the most part, negative, because, because like I said, in, in the past, um, I was looked at as a monster, I was, I was looked at as, as a, a alien to society, and, um, uh, it just brought a, a whole bunch of negative vibes, vibes that you don't want, especially when you're trying to do something positive, when you're trying to change your life over, become a productive citizen of society. But you understand society, though, right? You understand where it's, uh, those, uh, where it's coming from, the trepidation, the, the fear? Exactly. Yeah, some people, it's just, it might offend.
offend them, might scare them, kids, right? So, yeah. But it, it's a lesson though. It's a lesson for them, right? Yeah, it, it's a lesson learned and, and, and hopefully uh, the, the little homies that are coming up right now uh, that have facial tattoos right now, there, there is hope and, and there, there are places that, that are willing to help us. And, and like you'll see here uh, in the near future, uh, what I went to, hopefully the, uh, we'll get to film some of this. Uh, you'll, you'll get to see what's going on and, and what takes place. All right, so we'll check in in a little bit, okay? All right. So we're super excited to get started with you today. We are a part of reentry, and removing tattoos on the face is very life-changing, and we can't wait to get started. Face, do you have any questions? Mm, none right now. None, none that I can think of. Are you excited? I'm a little excited and a little nervous. Okay. Yeah. It's going to be fast. fast. You'll be surprised. It'll be worth it. And how many of uh, these uh, stores do you have? So right now we're in Scottsdale. Eventually we're going to be in Vegas and we're moving to other cities. So we are advanced laser tattoo removal specialists with over 14 years experience. And we've done a lot of face tattoo removals and we can't wait to get started and, and help you out. Thank you. Thank you. Appreciate it. Yes. Of course.
face. How do you feel? I feel great. Uh, there was a little bite to it, but it's tolerable. And uh, I'm just real appreciative for Eraser to have a program available to me. Uh, Big Art, uh, lots of thanks to you taking your time out of your day on your day off to come and help me, you know, go through this whole re-entry type program. That's what we're doing. We're working on it in little pieces. So today we just did one side of the face and then uh, probably about a week or so, I would say, we're gonna start working on the other side of the face. Awesome. So um, you guys have a grand opening happening? Soon? So our grand opening is October 14th from 11 to four. We're gonna have uh, Rob the Original come out, um, paint us a mural. So it should be a lot of fun, DJ, food, drinks. And what's your address? Uh, 2200 uh, North Scottsdale Road, Sweet R. What type of services do you offer? So we're gonna be offering uh, tattoo removal, hair removal, laser teeth whitening. Um, so far that's about it. Just face stuff, stuff like that. I wanna say thank you very much. for You guys reached out to me on TikTok. You saw the, the help that he needed. You guys stepped up. Here we are because you guys had the courage to reach out because you have a passion for helping others yep. the way Lost in Phoenix does. So thank you guys very much. We'll be back okay. again. Right. And uh, it was really nice meeting you guys. We'll We're happy to be a part of this guy's journey, man. So Absolutely. we're excited for it. Thank you. We're coming out of the coming out of the uh, tattoo removal ink eraser. We uh, met the owners. They're really awesome. Um, and how do you feel about the process that you just went through? Um, I feel hopeful. Uh, they told me that it's not going to be immediate. But over a period of time, the, the red blood cells attack the ink and, and it begins to lighten up and, and erase. Um, they, they receive me very well. They, they, they uh, welcome me with open arms. Um, I, I felt good about the people at Ink Eraser. And uh, it's going to be a lot of sessions, right? Uh, it's going to be a lot of sessions, a lot of going over there. parts of your face little by little but it's gonna be well worth it right definitely definitely um, it, it's gonna be well worth it uh, I'm, I'm, I'm just waiting for the time when people won't be looking at me like four or five times and then going the opposite way and they'll, they'll just I'll be like a, uh, a civilian again just walking through the stores walking through the neighborhoods just walking down the street to get a soda I'll, I'll just be an average Joe Trying, that's what you're trying to gain, right? Just uh, want to be accepted by society as a normal person, right? Exactly. And this is the, the, the first step, right? So you're also doing, uh, you're in a program, uh, I mean, you have housing, you're doing all the things you need to do to, you know, join society and be a productive member, right? So this is, uh, this is one of those steps. And so, you know, I, I, I applaud your, your courage Right, because you're the one that told me, he's like, hey, Art, like I, I want to get my tattoos removed. If you can go out there and, and, and ask, see if there's anybody that's willing to step up, and uh, the people at the Ink Eraser have done that. They've stepped up and they said, hey, we have a passion for helping people. Um, we want to help you with your uh, with your desire to remove those tattoos so that you can be you can feel better about yourself and be a productive member of society again so uh, all the thanks to the people at the ink eraser we'll, we'll get them we'll get to know them little by little right as we keep coming to for more sessions right, right. so it's uh this is going to be a process it's not you know, one and done right it's long term right um uh it's just it just takes longer you can't do the whole face all at once uh, this was this was they 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 chose like a little section of your face and then um that was about 15 minutes uh did it sting at all did it hurt what did it feel like uh it felt like a bee sting at first but then it, uh it became like raw and um it was something similar to getting a tattoo maybe just a little bit more higher on the scale of, of pain really than the actual tattoo wow so it hurts more to get it off than to get it on. Yes, yes. Interesting. I would have thought that the laser, laser is a little bit nicer. less. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but you know what? You didn't flinch. You didn't move at all. So uh, that's, that's because you really want this to 
to happen for you, right? You're really excited for, uh, you know, one day waking up and you can see your face, right? Right. Um, so uh, you have another appointment in about two weeks, right? Uh, actually, uh, October 1st. Okay. It will be the next appointment. Yep, so that's in about two weeks. So um, I'll, I'll be bringing you back and for session number two of many sessions, but it's well worth it because you want to regain control of your life. You want to um, uh, be a positive role model. Be a positive role model for all the youngsters out there, giving good advice, saying, hey, look, this is what I've done. I've made mistakes. Don't follow in my footsteps. The, it's better if you listen to your parents, if you stay in school, if you work hard and achieve your dreams, right? So um, it's never too late and you're a great example of that. But I applaud your courage. I applaud you uh, reaching out to me uh, because you recognize that sometimes people need help, right? And so right. this is me helping you and the ink eraser they stepped up to help you as well because you matter you're important and we can't wait to continue to help you to to, uh, to have that independence uh, for yourself okay so face thank you very much i appreciate you we'll be talking very soon okay yeah i, I really appreciate um the lost in phoenix foundation uh, i appreciate you big runner for for reaching out to me and helping me um i i, I just can't really explain it it, it means a lot to me. it really doesn't i just thank you very much. Thank you. Welcome, bro. Talk soon, okay? All right.